Hi, uh, this video tutorial I will cover uh, strategy design pattern implementation. Before you watch this video tutorial, please log into my channel and watch uh, strategy design pattern introduction, strategy design pattern real time example and uh, strategy design pattern class diagram video tutorials. Then come and watch this tutorial so that you will understand this tutorial very clearly. Okay. Now we will see the scenario where we can use uh, strategy design pattern. Uh, Steve goes to shopping mall and uh, he purchased uh, LED TV uh, washing machine. Okay, so that cost around uh, 90,000 rupees. After uh, purchasing this uh, LED TV and uh, washing machine, uh, Steve goes to bill counter and uh, he wants to pay the money. Okay, uh, he can pay the money uh, using uh, three different options. The first option is uh, he can use his uh, credit card and he can pay the money. Uh, second option is uh, he can use his uh, debit card and pay the money and uh, third option is uh, he can uh, pay the money by cash okay so from this uh, three option he has to choose one and uh, pay the money in the bill counter right uh, so as per uh, strategy design pattern for the particular uh, task there will be multiple uh, solutions will be there uh, from that uh, user has to choose uh, one solution at runtime right so uh, here uh, to pay the bill uh, steve has uh, three options uh, from that uh, he has to choose one and pay the money so this is the best example of uh, strategy uh, design pattern okay uh, this is the class diagram of the scenario which we have uh, just discussed uh, in the right side top you can see a payment strategy interface and it has abstract method pay and it accept uh, amount as uh, string okay and this interface is implemented by the concrete classes uh, debit card payment strategy by cash uh, payment strategy credit card payment strategy okay uh, because customer can uh, pay the money using uh, uh, three different strategy like we discussed in the scenario right and the left side you can see a uh, payment context and uh, customer has to choose one of this uh, uh, payment method and uh, that payment strategy uh, the customer has to set it in the uh, context by calling the set payment uh, strategy method so once strategy is set uh, the customer will pay using that particular uh, strategy suppose uh, customer choose uh, uh, debit card payment strategy then uh, uh, customer has to set debit card payment strategy by in the context by calling the set payment uh, strategy method then uh, using that uh, debit card uh, uh, payment mode uh, he can uh, pay the money by calling the pay method of uh, payment context okay and I will open Eclipse and I will show you the code so that you will understand clearly I have opened Eclipse uh, now we will see the code uh, here you can see the interface uh, payment strategy it has subtract method pay and it accepts uh, amount as uh, string okay and credit card payment strategy uh, which implements uh, payment strategy interface and provide implementation of uh, pay method here what i am doing is i am just displaying uh, the customer uh, pay the money using the credit card and next uh, debit card payment strategy uh, which implements uh, payment strategy interface and provide implementation of uh, pay method here i am just displaying customer pays the money using the debit card and uh, next one is uh, by cash uh, payment strategy and it implements uh, payment strategy interface and provide implementation of pay method so here what i'm doing is i'm just uh, displaying uh, customer pays the money uh, as a cash okay and uh, next one is uh, payment uh, context and uh, here uh, uh, customer will choose one of the payment strategy and uh, uh, set the strategy in the context by calling this method set payment uh, strategy okay and uh, pay method uh, so customer will call this uh, pay method and uh, uh, payment strategy will be set by the customer by calling this uh, set payment uh, strategy method so using that particular strategy uh, the amount will be paid using the uh, pay method okay and uh, this is a customer class uh, here what i am doing is I am getting uh, what uh, payment mode user wants to use in order to pay the money so I am asking uh, you want to pay using uh, credit card or debit card or by cash so I am getting that uh, input here uh, then I am asking uh, uh, the money how much money you wants to pay 
so that also I am getting then based on the payment uh, type user has uh, uh, given uh, I am setting the corresponding payment strategy in the context if it is credit card I am setting credit card payment strategy in the context if it is uh, debit card I am setting uh, debit card payment strategy in the context if it is uh, by cash uh, I am setting uh, by cash payment strategy in the context finally uh, I am calling contacts.pay method uh, so in the context uh, corresponding uh, payment strategy is setting setted right so based on that uh, strategy uh, the amount will be paid okay I will just run this program so it is asking uh, please enter the payment type so what I will do is I will first select uh, credit card then it is asking uh, the amount to pay I am entering 90,000 so you can see uh, in the payment context uh, credit card payment strategy has uh, has been set and uh, the customer pays the money using the credit card okay I will run this program again and I will give uh, a debit card as a payment type so amount to pay I'm giving uh, 90,000 so you can see a uh, debit card payment strategy is set in the payment context and uh, customer uh, pays the money uh, uh, 90,000 rupees using the debit card so based on the uh, payment type uh, user has uh, choose corresponding uh, payment strategy is uh, set in uh, context and using that uh, strategy the amount has been paid so this is the best example of uh, uh, strategy design pattern I hope you understand uh, strategy design pattern uh, implementation very clearly and I have put together uh, all this sample code in my blog called uh, Ramjati you can just uh, visit this uh, site and you can get the sample code and uh, this is about uh, strategy design pattern implementation thanks for watching bye